you see this is what I don't like about the hair like when it gets like this and I find myself having to chop off like parts of the hair and installing more packs I just I just don't like that it's still beautiful hair though mm. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm just going to be reviewing the Jamaican Bounce Crochet hair that I installed about two weeks ago. I just wanted to share with you guys my initial impressions about the hair, um, how I currently feel about the hair, and my nighttime routine. I hope you guys like this video. If you want to see more videos like this, please let me know in the comment section. So I initially installed this hair about two weeks ago. It took me less than three hours to install. The things I loved about the hair initially was that it was very affordable. It cost about eight Canadian dollars. If you're in the US, it's gonna be even cheaper for you. I only had to use four packs to achieve this look. If you haven't seen my crochet braid installation video, just click on the little icon on top here and you'll be able to watch that. Um, the hair was very easy to separate sometimes when you get more natural looking more afro textured hair it's very hard sometimes even impossible to separate without damaging the curl and the after separating the hair the curl still remained the same so that's what i liked about the hair initially now i'm just gonna go and talk about how i feel about the hair right now now that I've had the hair for about two weeks, some of my impressions about the hair have changed. Now, seeing as this is synthetic hair, I did have a lot of um, I didn't have a lot of um, high expectations with the hair. So some of the things that are negative, I completely expected. I'm just gonna start with the pros and then I will go with the cons. The pros about this hair. When I initially installed it, I wanted to be able to do three different hairstyles with this and I can still do that. I wanted to do the bangs. I wanted to be able to do a middle part which I can still do and I also wanted to do a side part which I can still do and a lot of times when I install crochet braids even though I have done these different parts the hair gets very matted and it's very hard to um, to separate to be able to change the direction of the hair I can still do that with this hair um, the hair um, for a summer hairstyle it's very good um, it looks like a lot of hair but it's very light and I love that about the hair moving on to the cons of the hair so first of all the hair got um, not matted because it's still manageable but it got hard very quickly initially when I installed the hair it was it was soft-ish but after like two days it just became like solid rock solid and i did not appreciate that about the hair like i said i didn't have high expectations of the hair but a lot of the times when i install like kinky curly hair i expect it to get hard within like a week this happened within two days so i did not like that about the hair it also lost its bounce i mean the hair is called jamaican bounce and if you watch my initial video when i move the hair you can see it looks really bouncy and now it looks kind of stiff and I did not like that about the hair finally um, the last thing I didn't like about the hair was that I constantly had to be shaping the hair and I guess this is this is not really to do with the hair but it's just the way I was like managing it the way I was moving it at all which caused the hair to be um to have all these like not this is not frizz to me this is just like you see this this is what i'm talking about so i constantly found myself chopping the hair and having to install extra packages and i did not like that about the hair now, i planned on having the hair for a month but because of this i'm going to be taking the hair off by the end of this weekend so before i go i just wanted to show you guys my nighttime routine with the hair it's very simple what I usually do is I just take my um, silk scarf, I bring all the hair to the front and then I just put the scarf over the hair and I make a knot. So it ends up looking like this. This is actually pretty cute. I might go out like this. <laughs> and then I just tie it at the back. 
Now, right now, I don't have my silk pillow. Usually, I just do this and I go to bed. But since I don't have my silk pillow, I also take my uh, bonnet. And then I just put it over the hair. And I just go to bed like this. And that's good for the night. Thank you guys so much for watching. And uh, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. <laughs> have a great day.